Welcome back to Innocence Cheryl. We're going to sit up here and do another Divine Masculine update. We're going to be using the Mystic Mohawk deck, okay? And um, once I finish shuffling, I will turn down the music after I finish shuffling, okay? Let's get into this energy. Everybody is doing well on this Friday, okay? Time is just sitting up here just passing, okay? Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button real quick, okay? Y'all need it. Whoever needs special prayer, please leave it in the comments, okay? And, um, yeah, I'll make, sure, I'll make sure that you guys get that special prayer. It's a lot of shit going on right now. We got to stay prayed up all the way up, okay? Mm-hmm. But we're getting stronger by the day. We're getting stronger by the day. Okay, let me pick these cards up. <clears throat> that fell on the floor. Okay. Okay, let's do this. So it looked like Divine Masculine, right? Divine Masculine start feeling sick, okay? So Divine Masculine go to the doctor because Divine Masculine think it's COVID, okay? So they get to sitting up here doing all kind of blood tests on Divine Masculine and everything, okay? The Divine Masculine thinking that he been feeling sick because of COVID. Comes to be that Divine Masculine sit up here find out that he got a fucking STD, okay? And he pissed the fuck off about it, okay? What this card say? It say, what it say? Let me see. 
it say unfavorable health results, okay? So whatever it is, it damn sure wasn't fucking COVID, okay? He thought it was COVID. That's why he went to the hospital to sit up here and go investigate. Wanted to sit up here and know why he was sitting up here feeling the way that he was feeling, okay? Come to find out Divine Masking got an STD, okay? Divine Masking been sitting up here missing in action, ain't been sitting up here dealing with you, okay? Because Divine Masculine been sitting up here healing from a damn STD. This is why Divine Masculine ain't been around. He went to the doctor. He told him he had an STD. And we, and we see what this card say. It say healing from an STD. So he done got the shot and everything. Okay. He healing from this STD. This is the reason why your Divine Masculine is very distant. Ain't dealing with you. Okay. Divine Masculine don't, don't know if he done gave it to you. So he don't want to have sex with you right now because he thinking he already done got the shot. He healing. So the reason why he ain't having sex with you is because he's sitting up here too ashamed to tell you that he had an STD that you need to go to the doctor to go get checked out. He just figured that you'll find out that on your own. So Divine Masculine don't have no intentions right now on dealing with you, being around you, hanging out with you, talking to you, because Divine Masculine thinks that you got the STD that he's caring from because he's not willing to keep it real and tell you that he might have gave you an STD. He rather you find out on your own. So your divine masculine, he ain't, it, he, it's not that he really don't want to sit up here and be around you. Divine masculine feel like, well, if I can't have sex with her, okay, I already got the shot. He don't want to sit up here and contract whatever he, whatever he found out that he had that he didn't got cured from. Okay. Divine masculine, cold, calculated motherfucker ain't he? Divine Masculine is sitting up here like, I ain't going to deal with her. I'm just going to get my shot and I not say nothing or anything, okay? But, yeah, Divine Masculine got STD for somebody else, okay? Or one of his other karmics thinking that it was COVID, thinking that he just didn't do six feet distant. And to come to find out, Divine Masculine got an STD. And then Divine Masculine is walking around here scorned, upset, not really knowing who then gave him this STD. He don't know to say something. He don't know how to sit up here and feel. All he know is that he's sitting up here getting um getting this STD cured, okay? And he ain't sitting up here dealing with nobody because he don't know who he done got this from. Divine Masculine plans on dealing with all new people since he done sat up here and got this shot and he's healing from this STD. Because he don't know exactly who then gave him this STD out of all the karmics that he does deal with. Mm-hmm. And see, that's the toxic ass shit that Divine Masculine thinks him about all the time is his fucking self. That's how toxic he is. Gonna make sure that he okay, but not keep it real. See, Divine Masculine don't understand that God's lesson for him here on earth is for him to learn how to keep it real, for him to learn how to tell the fucking truth and speak up, for him to have integrity, okay? But he keep on feeling the lesson. He always takes the coward way out. He always sit up here and put himself first. Long as he okay, he don't give a damn about the rest. This is what Divine Masculine toxic ass ways do all the fucking time. He always there for himself and nobody else. Even when he wrong, he never wants to fess up. Even when he know he should be doing things in a different way, he still had those toxic ass, mean fucking about himself, selfish ass ways about himself. Like, I'm just going to save myself type shit. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's how Divine Masculine sitting up here thinking. Because Divine Masculine, ever since Divine Masculine that got out of jail, Divine Masculine, this Divine Masculine been different, okay? He been real different. This Divine Masculine, even though he don't really say shit, he just act different. He ain't got no comment on nothing that done happened up in there. But you just know that he has changed since he's been to jail. You just see your Divine Masculine just different. Something just different about him. Cold, more colder, more meaner than normal. You know what I'm saying? And your Divine Masculine is always out for himself. You know what I'm saying? 
That's just the way he's been. It's, it's the same old shit. Same old shit. He sit up here acting the same ass fucking way, okay? And he just act like he just for himself. He don't he don't show that nurturing, okay, that he needs to sit up here and show because he didn't get it, okay? But yeah. Divine masculine and this karmic, okay? They over there arguing and fighting, okay? Divine masculine that caught the karmic all on the internet, sitting up here cheating, okay? I just seen another cheating card somewhere. Oh, I'm going to find it, okay? Yeah, the karmic be sitting up here making money online, okay? Sitting up here getting her fuck on fucking online to sit up here and make money, okay? This is what this bitch be sitting up here doing to make extra fucking money. And Divine Masculine and caught this bitch, okay? This is why he's feeling so scorned about the STD, okay? Now it's, now it's coming together, okay? Yeah, he done caught this bitch sitting up here on the internet cheating, okay? Making money on the internet. Sitting up here selling them cookies, okay? This is why Divine Masculine and her be sitting up here arguing because she studies sitting up here getting caught. The reason that this karmic sits up here and she fucks around and don't respect herself like she should is because she was molested. Your Divine Masculine could have been molested, okay? That could be the reason why he's so sexual the way that he is, okay? But somebody is one of divine masculine lovers is watching him in the background. Okay, this karmic is keeping an eye on him. Okay, and you know who the karmic that's keeping an eye on divine masculine? His lover, the one that he set up here, been sitting up here sleeping with in a relationship with undercover. Okay, the boyfriend, the boyfriend watching the karmic. Okay, ready to expose divine masculine. Okay, his boyfriend. Okay, his boyfriend want him for himself. He tired of sitting up here hiding in the shadows. He tired of sitting up here not letting everybody know what's going on. And whoever divine masculine is sitting up here sleeping with, he ready to sit up here and tell divine masculine family and friends that they are in a relationship together and been fucking. Whoever this guy is, this bro, this homie, lover, friend, is ready to sit up here and expose Divine Masculine on what they've been sitting up here doing behind closed doors. Okay? And Divine Masculine is hurt and don't want that. Why Divine Masculine out here sitting up here sleeping with women and shit, Divine Masculine really more get more attractive and in this crazy Jerry Springer splash of different relationships, okay? Ryan Masson confused as a motherfucker, okay? And his boyfriend don't give a damn. His boyfriend is ready to sit up here and be on that fuck shit, ready to get some shit popping, and ready to sit up here and tell what Divine Masculine and him really be doing. Because the boyfriend done fell in love with Divine Masculine's booty. Real good and tight, okay? I guess. Whatever... He loving, but he loving it, okay? To the point he got to have divine masculine to himself and whoever this boyfriend is, he ready to sit up here and drop the dime on divine masculine, okay? Divine masculine sitting up here trying to ghost whoever this boyfriend is. The boyfriend ain't having that. The boyfriend gonna keep his eye on divine masculine, okay? The boyfriend said, the hell with you thinking that you gonna ghost me. He said he'll expose his motherfucking ass before any of that, okay? Mm. But Divine Masculine sitting up here acting like he from the streets, okay? But this is what his boyfriend is sitting up here sending him, even in text messages and everything. Divine Masculine is supposed to be this gangster. He's supposed to be in the streets acting like he's so hard, he this, he that. He really on the block with Divine Mask and got a boyfriend. And his boyfriend is very upset, sending him text messages, ready to expose him, threatening Divine Masculine right now. Okay, that's what... 
the boyfriend is about to sit up here and do, okay? I'm going to sit up here and send these text messages, okay? And have been sending text messages, okay? Letting Divine Masculine know what time it is and what he will do, okay? And Divine Masculine, he's so mad about what he going through with the boyfriend, okay? And the hate mail, okay? He's so mad about the boyfriend and the text messages and everything that him and the karmic, they over there really getting into it, okay? Heavy. The karmic don't know what she doing to set Divine Masculine off right now, okay? But Divine Masculine know why he don't want, because he know that this dude is ready to sit up here and expose him. The boyfriend is sending text messages, okay? Sending text messages, telling telling him that he will expose everything, okay? And Divine Masculine is mad about it. He taking his shit out on the fucking karmic, making it like it's an issue, trying to break up with her real quick before this shit come out. Because the boyfriend and told Divine Masculine he ain't clean, okay? So Divine Masculine has switched all the way up on the karmic. She don't know what's going on right now. Divine Masculine is extra hard on her right now. The karmic sitting up here feeling like a straight loser, okay? It's the truth. Divine Masculine treat her like that. Because her ass, he done caught her ass sitting up here selling her ass, making money on the internet and shit. Okay. She's a high price toll. Okay. And ever since then, Divine Masculine and her ain't been sitting up here dealing, um, getting along. Okay. This is why Divine Masculine is so scorned because he don't know who he done sat up here and then got this STD from, okay? He don't know if he sat up here. Then hold on. I'm sorry, y'all. He don't know if he sat up here then got this STD from the karmic. Okay, I tried to do four, but I said that ain't going to work. We're going to just keep it at three. Divine Masculine don't know if he got this STD from the boyfriend. Divine Masculine don't know if he got it from the karmic. And this is why Divine Masculine is walking around upset, okay? The boyfriend and the karmic and Divine Masculine can have this STD, okay? It could be something horrible because didn't we not see? But you know what? It, it, it said curable, but it said unfavorable. Oh, okay. I get it. Thank you. Thank you, Spirit. Okay, remember remember this card, okay? It said unfavorable results, okay? So that's when he got the results saying that he did have the STD. But whatever the STD is, it is curable, okay? Because he said he is healing. He didn't got the shot, okay? With Divine Masculine, he ain't trying to deal with nobody, okay? Because he don't want to tell the boyfriend or the karmic that he got this STD, Divine Master trying to walk away from both of them, okay? Because he finished it up here and get exposed. The boyfriend already feel it coming on. He already feel it coming on. This is why Divine Masculine is our when he start giving um hate mail and everything. Text messages, talking shit about exposing Divine Masculine, because Divine Masculine had ghosted this boyfriend. Okay. Stop seeing this boyfriend. Okay. When Divine Masculine was sitting up here, um, Found out that he had an STD. Divine Masculine goes to the boyfriend and start pulling back on the karmic, okay? And when Divine Masculine did that, the boyfriend got mad, started sending all type of text messages talking about that he will expose Divine Masculine, okay? Divine Masculine pissed the fuck off. But, and the karmic's sitting up here sleeping with other people, and it's just a, a hailstorm over there, okay? Mm-hmm. Divine Masculine, he just be doing fake love all up in the karmic face, okay? Divine Masculine, he don't give a fuck. Ever since he done caught the karmic cheating and everything, he ain't respecting her. He ain't giving a damn. Divine Masculine be on his phone right in front of her, and she be on her phone right in front of him talking to other people under the same roof. 
They have no respect for each other, okay? Every time you turn around, it's always all type of fucking skeletons coming out the closet, okay, about divine masculine and this karmic, okay? I mean, Divine Matthew, he just met his same person because they doing this shit all up in, in, in all up in each other's faces, okay? But she, she cheating, but not knowing that Divine Matthew got the shot. Not knowing that she got an STD. Or maybe she do, okay? But it's a whole lot of fluids and a whole lot of sex swapping going on to the point that that much juice and saliva and blood and whatever else, okay, going on in people's, um, you, you know, um, kitty cats and all type of shit. Come on now. That's why it's very important to sit up here and be monogamous because people be out here cheating, people be out here doing shit, and people don't be out here keeping the shit real. Okay, people out here sitting up here just passing STDs around to people, knowing that they fucking four to five, two to three, whatever amount of other people not being monogamous. Okay, not being true to one. Mm -mm. Not me. Hell nah. I went and got my ass a fucking massager and some KY jelly. I was like, oh, no, I'm gonna make sure I handle myself if it come down to. Okay. Well, for real, I'd rather not deal with the drama and still be over and done with. <laughs> okay, gets the job done. Okay, on some real shit with no headache, no drama, no STDs, and ain't got to sit up here and worry about no fucking man sitting up here cheating and mistreating. Okay, mm -mm. And I ain't talking about no dildo or nothing like that, but I'm sitting up here just talking about a little massage, just right on the top, and boop, 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 it's over and done with. Some KY jelly. I'm trying to tell y'all. Save your cookie. Don't give that cookie out to nobody unless they earn that cookie. Okay? On some real shit. You rather deal you don't want to deal with the headache because people is having STDs. People out here cheating. People out here got skeletons in their closet. And people ain't keeping it real right now. Okay? You don't know if people is straight, by whatever. People just not keeping it real. It ain't about what you do, it's how you do it. And people ain't keeping it real. And you don't want to sit up here and die over no fucking STD. That shit ain't fucking worth it. Oh, it's some sex? Oh, no. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No, you keep on praying to God for God to sit up here and send you the man or woman that he wants you to be with, that he knows is right for you, heavenly sent. And you sit up here and keep your cookie closed, keep that jar closed until you meet that right person. Okay, it's other ways to sit up here and get the job done, wink, wink, if you have to. Okay, instead of sitting up here being stupid, feeling stuck, embarrassed and having an STD because of motherfucker done lied and, and playing games and out here cheating. Okay, I don't want that for none of y'all. Okay, period. Because it's, it's finna get real out here in these streets. Okay? You already see we living in revelations right now. Okay? People ain't keeping it real. People grimy. People just, man, got to stay prayed up. Okay? And then they, they, these pedophiles, you get it with a man. What if the man want to sit up here and be with your daughter or, or your son or what? And molestation, the boyfriends is killing killing um these women's kids these women leaving their kids with men that they just met and shit <coughs> see how the devil trying to make me stop talking to protect these babies so not here meeting these men and giving stds and having sex with kids and doing all type of shit okay and it's just not worth it and sometimes it's best to make sure you take care of the job yourself that's all i'm saying Okay, <clears throat> and now Divine Masculine, he running from the fucking truth, okay? He got, he thought that the karmic was his babe, okay? Thought he had two babes, now he running from the truth because this other dude is sitting up here, threatening to sit up here and expose Divine Masculine, okay? 
Now, Divine Masculine got all kind of narcissistic behavior. He taking it out on everybody around him. Everybody asking him what's wrong. He ain't saying shit, no comment, but he's sitting up here acting out. Everybody see that something is wrong with Divine Masculine. Nobody's knowing that Divine Masculine is sitting up here being toxic because of this fucking lover, okay? that said that they would sit up here and expose Divine Masculine. This is why he's acting so out of control right now, okay? This is why he's so in his feelings. Everything is bothering him. He pissed off about everything for no fucking reason. You say good morning, he grouchy and growling and shit, phone in the side of his mouth and shit, just on one. That's why he on one, okay? And then he's sitting up here and just coming, I mean... How Divine Masculine has been with the karmic right now, you wouldn't believe. It ain't roses over there. Divine Masculine all up in her face, making her feel like shit, extra toxic, okay? Mad at itself, taking it out on her, all type of shit, okay? Divine Masculine is tripping over there. And he and he just said, and he over there healing from an STD too, not knowing if his boyfriend or girlfriend that gave it to him. Divine Masculine piss jumping shit off. Don't know what the fuck you do over there, okay? Mm -mm. And then the karmic sitting up here is pregnant, okay? Divine Masculine feeling like, damn, another damn baby, okay? He pissed off about this baby that's coming here or been delivered, but that baby's delivered. This is a new baby. Or it will, or it will be a new baby being born real quick, okay? That's why Divine Masculine is on one. But some type of shit is finna go down that might end up having Divine Masculine in fucking jail, okay? Divine Masculine might feel like sitting up here putting his hands on this fucking dude that's trying to expose his ass, okay? Divine Masculine might be sitting up here thinking about going over there doing something about it. Divine Masculine don't take too kindly to threats. He don't take too kindly for someone sitting up here saying that they're going to expose him. Okay, divine masculine came up in his head that he gonna fuck somebody up. That he don't give a damn about going to jail to silence this lover, this guy that's trying to sit up here and expose divine masculine and a sexual escapades. Mm hmm. Divine masculine gonna go do put hands on this dude because he ain't liking this dude stay sitting up here sending him text messages talking about he going to tell his family, friends, and the karmic, everybody that Divine Masculine look up to and, and things like that. Divine Masculine don't want this information out. Divine Masculine is starting to sit up here and believe that this lover that he's been sleeping with, his bro love shit that he's been doing undercover with the homie, he don't want this information now. And he's he's ready to sit up here and do what he got to sit up here and do. And what Divine Masculine feel like he going to sit up here and do about the situation. Okay, hold on. Divine Masculine feel like he going to take it to the streets. Divine Masculine feel like he going to have to put a hoodie on and put in work to silence this lover. To silence this homie. Okay, that he been sleeping with his friend, his homeboy, okay? He don't want this to get out. So he finna suit up, and, to, and it might end up having Divine Masculine in jail. Divine Masculine might even be thinking about sitting up here killing this lover to keep his mouth shut, okay? Because Divine Masculine is not sitting up here willing for everybody to sit up here and hear the skeletons in his closet about sleeping with someone, okay? Oh, you know what? God just told me Divine Masculine might be sitting up here thinking that this motherfucker sat up here and gave him an uncurable disease. This might be the reason why Divine Masculine might go over there and fuck him up or literally kill this boy. Okay, because Divine Masculine is pissed about this STD. Okay, that could be the reason. But what I do know is somebody finna shut the hell up. Divine Masculine don't give a fuck if we got to put his black hoodie on and go get some homies to take out this person. Or he gonna do it himself. But Divine Masculine, hmm, might end up in jail after this shit. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes, Divine Masculine could have sat up here and met this lover online, and this lover was sitting up here paying Divine Masculine money undercover, gay for pay. This could be a lover that Divine Masculine sat up here was sleeping with for money, that the lover ended up falling in love with him. Okay. But whatever it is, all the skeletons is about to come out the closet about this shit. Everybody going to be watching and paying attention on what happens and be listening to what information is about to sit up here and come out, okay? And Divine Masculine is not willing for that information to be out. He don't want everybody to be looking at him crazy. He don't want everybody to be sitting up here knowing that he's bisexual, he's gay. Divine Masculine can't take the way that people is going to look at him after this information is exposed. This is why Divine Masculine said, uh-uh. Uh-uh. Hmm. Where'd it go? Divine Masculine said, uh-uh. I have your fucking head on a platter. <laughs> this is some real shit. Tarot really be set up here telling what really be going on. He said, I have your head on the platter and I go to jail before I let your ass expose me on what the fuck we be sitting up here doing. This shit was never supposed to get out, okay? Divine Master said shit. This was something that was supposed to have been kept quiet. This is something that's supposed to have been kept to, the, to me and you. Now you're trying to expose me? Hmm. Divine Master said, nah, it'll get into some gangster shit before that happened. He said, I'll put my black hoodie on and I'll come for you and put your head on the platter. I mean, take you out. And he said he'll end up in jail before he lets that information and them skeletons to come out. Divine Masculine ain't having it. And the reason why Divine Masculine was down to sleep with this person is because he was molested as a child. Okay, Divine Masculine has been attracted to men some type of way. Okay. But this man was paying Divine Masculine to sleep with him, whoever this is, okay? But Divine Masculine, he really sitting up here, written. uh-uh, told you. Hmm, I ain't lying. Hold on, y'all. I told y'all after them fucking text messages and shit, Divine Masculine was like, "Uh uh-uh, you better watch your back, okay? Divine Masculine started plotting right then and there to watch his fucking back, okay? Yep, Divine Masculine is really sitting up here, thinking about sitting up here, going to jail to silence him, okay? Whoever that lover is, you best to be aware. You better shut up and get out of town because Divine Masculine is coming for you. Oh, yes. Mm-hmm. He wants your head on a fucking platter, and he's willing to sit up here and do time, okay? Not wanting everybody to sit up here and be talking and gossiping about him and this lover. Divine Masculine can't take it. He can't take it, won't take it, okay? Okay. <laughs> 